Hi! Today, we're going to be exploring the wonderful world of Nookazon. So, to be completely honest, I haven't used Nookazon all that much, but I've been getting a lot of requests to do a Nookazon video, so I thought that today we'd start. I'm standing right now in front of a bunch of items. Not a bunch. I probably should have more, but we're just going to see where these few items take us. I have a couple fake and a couple real art pieces. I have the Statue of Liberty, a moon chair, Meringue's photo, and a dreamy dress and also in my inventory i have 10 blue rose plants that i'm trying to sell because those are rare and people want them sometimes i think i don't know my goal here is to make at least a million bells from trading these items i know before like in the whole nook is on market like i was able to make a million bells so easily i would sell like one or two art pieces and bam i'd be a millionaire but i feel like the market has definitely changed i think the demand for things are kind of like going down people aren't paying as much for different items right now in the bank let me show you i don't have that much money i have seven hundred thousand bells and again by the end of this our goal is to be a millionaire and then in another Nook is on video, I think what we're gonna do, if we do end up making, you know, a million or more bells, I think we're gonna be just like dropping off a bunch of bells at random people's islands on Nook is on just to, you know, give them something nice. I don't know. This is my Nook is on account. I don't have any listings yet. I'm gonna right now actually list everything that we have, but also Nook is on stresses me out. I don't know why. I just feel like if I don't get back to people right away, they're gonna get upset and I'm gonna like miss something. And I don't know. I just, I... I don't know. I don't want to make people mad. But today we're going to get over that fear. I'm going to put all my listings up. I'm going to ask for offers, but only accept bells. So we'll see what people are wanting to bid on our items. I feel like blue roses can generally go for a lot. At least they used to. I'm going to add one fake wild painting, left half, and then the right half. I'll be adding the crescent moon chair, which I think will probably go the fastest. This is what I'm going to guess. I'm going to guess that this is going to be the one that people are going to want to buy the most. Because I feel like this is just like a hot and happening item all the time. Oh no, did you hear the bing? We already have a, okay, it's fine. <laughs> I'm so stressed out already. Oh my gosh, that was two. Uh, okay, we have an offer for our blue roses. We have 300,000 bells. I feel like that's a good price. Let's accept it. I'll request her dodo code. The crescent moon chair is going crazy. 350,000 for our crescent moon chair. I mean, that's pretty good. Like we're already at 600,000 if we accept this. Okay, this person gave us their dodo. <laughs> the dings are gonna kill me. I've only seen a handful of Nookazon videos, but I feel like nobody ever seems frazzled or stressed. I'm stressed. Oh, another ding. Huh, stop dinging, please. <laughs> okay, we're headed to Bali and we're gonna drop off these roses and then we'll recheck the offers for our crescent moon chair and see what we're gonna get. Oh, their island's really cool. Look at that custom design on the ground. I like getting to go to other people's islands like for trades and stuff because I get to see like their designs. I get to see how they're decorating their island and I think it's the funnest thing. Are they doing multiple trades at once? No. <laughs> While someone else is flying over right now, we got a new offer for 400,000 bells for our crescent moon chair. So I'm going to accept and then message them that we're in the middle of a trade right now before we get the Dodo code and stuff. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. And I'm just going to plant him right here, I think. I hope it's okay to be planting them right here. I didn't even ask where I should plant them. Thank you so much. That was a good trade. They're buying a lot of blue roses. Look at them. <laughs> okay, well, trade number one was a success. So that's good. We didn't get scammed and we got 300,000 bells. One step closer to getting a million. <laughs> Write a review. Five stars, 10 out of 10. Fast and easy trade. Thank you so much. Okay, we're back on our island. I'm gonna open my gate so that our other trader can come on over and we'll get 400,000 bells in exchange for a crescent moon chair, which is so good. And this person, honestly, they have a lot of a lot of good reviews. Like you could see they have 68 reviews. Their rating is five stars. So I'm not worried about getting scammed at all from them. Some people that we're trading with today, I'm sure I'll be a little bit wary and just a little bit worried that, you know, it's not gonna, we're not gonna get what we're paying for, but it's okay. While we're waiting, I'm gonna list our dreamy dress. Again, just asking for bell offers. Maybe somebody will want a yellow dreamy dress. Those were really, really popular. Like in the beginning of the game, the dreamy clothing was just like ridiculously popular and everybody wanted it. I don't know if that's still a thing, so I guess we'll see. Also here gonna add our Statue of Liberty. I feel like Gulliver's items normally go for a lot. I tried the other day to trade villagers on Nookazon and that did Oh, here they come. It did not go well at all. Like, let me just tell you, it did not go well. I sold an ungifted marshal. I got like 20 tickets for him. Like it was, oh, it was ridiculous. I don't know what's happening with the whole Nookazon trading market, but it's it's not airing in my favor. Oh, their Avi's really cute. Look at their, look at their little dress. I want that custom design. Oh, that's so pretty. Oh, look at Pico in the background. What a cutie. She's like, oh, we have a visitor. Pico's like, can I have the bells? I would enjoy some bells. <laughs> Yay, thank you so much, Brie. Five stars, 10 out of 10. Super quick and easy trade. Thank you so much. These are our listings right now. I feel like I should add a few more. Let's pick up the bells that we do have and then put them in the bank. Okay, so we're just gonna deposit all 700,000 bells, which means we officially, again, have over 1 million bells 
in our bank. Here we are. The time's come. I'm very happy. <laughs> I've been poor for so long, so I'm really excited. You know what I think I might do is craft another crescent moon chair? <laughs> Since that, like, I mean, we got a lot of offers really quickly on that, and I haven't gotten offers for anything else. Let me also list the rest of our stuff. So I have the detailed painting. And I believe mine's genuine. Five minutes later. So the genuine detailed art has the blue like foliage and then the fake one has purple. So that's blue. We're good. It's real. We can list it as genuine. We also have the dynamic painting, which is always genuine. So that's great. Since we haven't gotten any little pings from Nookazon in a while, let's go make our little crescent moon chair and see if anybody wants to buy a second one. Because if we can again get like 400,000 bells for it, I feel like that would be... I mean, that's a good profit for just one item. I also... So in my... Oh, I got a ping. Hold on. Someone made an offer for a Statue of Liberty. Let's see what they're offering. 100,000 bells. I'm pretty sure if you look on Nookazon, it says it's worth like a million. The average price that it's sold for is 1.2 million. Uh, I don't think I'm going to accept 100,000 bells. We got two new reviews, so that's great. Five stars. Maybe more people will trade with us now. But anyway, like I had said before, let's go ahead, grab some star fragments, and make one more crescent moon chair and see if we can make another 400k. I feel like we're gonna get pinged quite a few times from this again, so I guess we'll see. Let's try not to get too overwhelmed. Another cool thing about Nookazon is that they list the hot items for the day. So the hot items for today, which apparently are the ones that are really selling, are the mystery grab bag, large star fragment, diner counter table, and book. None of which I really have in my storage. If we don't get any other offers, maybe we'll take that. But I think for now, we're gonna wait. If I just deny it, is that mean though? I feel like that's really mean to deny offers. <laughs> I don't want to be a mean person. No one else is bidding on our Statue of Liberty. I mean, it's only been 16 minutes, but I think we're just going to take it. Okay, so I accepted their offer of 100,000 bells for our Statue of Liberty, which I know I'm getting ripped off, but you know what? It'll probably make them happy. This is not very good for my millionaire aspiration, but we already have a million bells in the bank, so I think we're okay. I want to get a few million. We can go and drop it off at people's islands when we're doing trades. I don't know. I feel like especially for like people just starting the game, like getting bells is really difficult. Trying to farm for bells by fishing and bug catching and selling your fossils. Like I feel like it can take a long time. So to be able to like give bells to people who need it or who, you know, want certain items and can't get it, I just feel like it'd be nice for them to get some bells. So I'm hoping we'll make enough bells from this little Nookazon exploration that we can give back to some people. But if not, you know what? Then we have bells for a rainy day or a snowy day. They're on the way for the Statue of Liberty. I like that Nookazon gives you those, those updates so you know when people are coming and you know what to expect. <laughs> there we go. Looks like someone's on their way here. They're also wearing a really cute custom design. Where are people getting these? <laughs> They said, love your island, by the way. Thank you so much. You can take the Statue of Liberty for whatever price you want. You're a very kind person. You can take it for free. <laughs> Gotta hit him with the dancing emote. A little shake your booty. Okay, let's see what our pings were for. Ooh, someone made an offer for Meringue's photo. Two million bells? How much does it normally go for? Am I about to get scammed here? No, that's the average price. I did not know that villager photos went for that many bells. Are you kidding me? So I already have one of Meringue's photos. That's how good of friends we are. Um, but no, she gave me two. So I, I was like, let's just sell this one. I knew villager photos went for like quite a bit, but I was not expecting two million. So I'm going to accept the offer and send the dodo code. Okay, so the person bidding on Meringue's photo said, I'll be over in a minute finishing a trade and I need to pull the bells out. Thank you. No, thank you. I cannot believe that Meringue's photo goes for that much. I mean, it makes sense because like to get the villager photos, it's kind of a lot of work. I mean, if we genuinely get 2 million bells for Meringue's photo, I mean, I'm assuming we will. They don't look like they're a scammer. The reviews are amazing. Verified sales, five stars all the way through. So that is very promising. I'm really excited. Has she been here the whole time? I genuinely did not even see her here at all. None of our paintings or statues, like our, our art from Red, none of it's gotten any bid. That's a little confusing to me as well because that's literally all I used to sell. It's kind of cool to see how things are changing and what people are looking for now is so different from, I guess, when I used to trade a lot, which was, I mean, that was months ago. So back in my day, no, I'm just kidding. Yeah, I am like not in with the times anymore. I have no clue what's, what's hot and what's not. Okay, we just got a ping that the trader is on their way for Meringue's photo. So I'm really excited. Here they come. All their Avi's really cute too. Everybody's avatar is so cute what the heck this video honestly just feels so jumbled and like all over the place i think because we have so many listings going i say so many we only have like six look at this thank you so much wow 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 Pico's like, what did you just trade to get all of this? <laughs> That's crazy. Let's pick up these bells really quickly. We'll put them in the bank. Look at that. We have 3 million bells in the bank. So that was pretty fun. That was 
stressful. It was probably just about as stressful as I thought it was going to be. I knew I was going to be like frazzled and stuff the whole time, which I was. But you know what? I, we made quite a bit of bells, quite a bit of bank. I hope you guys enjoyed this little Nookazon video. This has been requested a ton. It was always in the back of my mind, like do a Nookazon video, but I had no clue what to do. So I was like, let's just make a few bells. I don't really know what I'm doing. So if this was just a hot mess, I apologize. Very sorry. We don't have to do any more of these, but if you did enjoy it, give it a thumbs up. Um, subscribe if you want to. Leave a comment if you'd like us to make more Nookazon videos. Let me know if you use Nookazon and how often you use it. And if you're like a Nookazon pro, let me know how the heck you don't get so frazzled when you're using it because my, I cannot handle it. <laughs> but thank you so, so much for watching. I'll see you very, very soon in the next video. Until then, stay safe and take care. Bye.